Hi, Bridges for the Deaf and Hard of Hearing is excited to share that the bill we introduced with the Tennessee General Assembly in January of this year is now law. The bill sponsored by Representative Jason Powell and Senator Steve Dickerson was signed by Governor Lee on May 8, 2019. The new law changes the terms hearing impaired and hearing impairment to deaf or hard of hearing and hearing loss. This important change takes place in all parts of the Tennessee Annotated Code, except the Education Section. The Tennessee Department of Education recently changed education law terminology to match language used in federal legislation. That federal legislation still uses the terms hearing impaired and hearing impairment. Unfortunately, the Tennessee Department of Education would not support changing the language in the education sections of the law. But the Department of Education did agree to change all the language on their website and communications. They also agreed to support changing the language at the federal level. To send out information encouraging local school systems to change their language. And to engage deaf and hard of hearing adults in decisions made about deaf and hard of hearing education. The language change in the new law respects the cultural and linguistic community that is our deaf and hard of hearing community and removes the stigma of impairment or brokenness from our community. While hearing impairment was originally introduced into the lexicon in an attempt to be polite or politically correct, the language continues to imply a brokenness or less than status that does not accurately reflect who we are or all we can do. It reinforces a historical perspective that has been harmful to deaf and hard of hearing individuals. Reinforcing stereotypes that have resulted in oppression and discrimination. This language change also empowers us to define ourselves rather than accept a label given to us by people outside our community. As we continue to advocate for the rights of the deaf and hard of hearing, and to educate the rest of the world on our history and equality, words are powerful. They help shape our understanding and perceptions of one another. And they set the foundation for important conversations that help us all move forward together. Words do matter. Thank you to the Tennessee General Assembly and to every person who contacted legislators to support this new law. This law is from for and by our deaf and hard of hearing community. Congratulations to all.
Bridges for the Deaf and Hard of Hearing is excited to continue our advocacy work to identify barriers and remove them so that we create a more just and inclusive community for all. For more information on the work of Bridges for the Deaf and Hard of Hearing, please visit bridgesfordeafandhh.org. Thank you.